Good afternoon, everybody. Naima Singletary here, BillionDollarCourage.com. Today is Friday, July 1st, and we are six months through 2011, and I am incredibly grateful to be here with you today. It, I'm just incredibly grateful to be here. You know, my sincerest intent in producing these video blogs every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday here at BillionDollarCourage.com is to inspire women and teens all over the globe to push through their fears and self-doubts so they can show up in life and live on purpose, to live in power. Because I know that by doing that, that will reach others across the nation, across the globe, across the universe. And I know just by me doing my small part, there are other women being infected with their own power and are bubbling up inside with their own power. And naturally, they are touching other people in their communities as well. And if every person, if every woman, if every teen shows up in power, pushing through their fear and self-doubt, this world will shift and it is shifting. And I am a part of that movement and I want you to be a part of that movement. And that is my intention in producing these video blogs every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Okay. So today I want to discuss self-care is the sister to courage, to showing up. If you ask anyone who's living a very mundane, boring life, why they are not living their dreams or what their passion is, why they are not living it, it will show up in some form of self-doubt or fear. But it'll sound something like this. I'm not sure anybody cares. I'm not sure anybody will listen. I'm not sure what to do. I don't have enough time. I don't have the money. I don't have the support. What will my friends think? Um, am I worthy? Who cares about what I have to say? What if I fail? All of these statements and beliefs are self-doubt and fear showing up, all right? However, what I have discovered on my own personal path of being better, of doing better, of living on purpose, of showing up in my life, is that when I intentionally do things that nurture me, that care for me, I feel confident. My confidence increases and naturally I feel the courage. I'm able to hold on to my courage, which carries me through my fear, which carries me through my self-doubt so that I can show up in the way that I need to show up. So an example of self-care self-care, is working out. I work out four or five days a week. Me taking care of myself in that way, stretching my body, flexing my body, giving attention to my body on a regular basis makes me feel like I am important. I have a ritual. I enjoy drinking green tea, whether it's morning, noon, or night. I always have a glass in the morning. And that ritual of sitting down, drinking the tea, enjoying the warmth down my throat, watching it, um, uh, what's the word? I forget the word. When you allow it to sit and rest before you actually drink it, to sit and think and enjoy going down my throat, the all of those, that's a ritual for me. And that's a part of my self-care. Washing my skin, paying attention to my hair, um, really being with my body. I kiss myself. I kiss my hands. I kiss my legs. I kiss whatever part of my body I can reach with my lips, my arms. And really saying to myself, Naima, you are worthy. You are lovely. You are special. And really allowing that to seek in, sink in when I'm alone and really feeling the feelings of saying that to myself, those processes of self-care fuel my confidence and my courage because I have very important work to do. Me doing this right here is incredibly important to me. It is necessary in order for me to be a contribution to this world. And it is what you need to do, without a doubt. I know it is what you need to do to continue to increase your confidence, which naturally will increase your courage. So that is the message for today, that self-care is the sister to courage and confidence. So that's the message for today. Thank you very much for being here. Um, enjoy your weekend. I hope it's for productive and restful for you. And I will be back on Monday, the 4th of July. I know many of you will be doing other things, but many of you will also be here with me. <laughs> so thank you very much. Naima Singletary, BillionDollarCourage.com. See you on Monday.